Hello, hello. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Amos, what's up? How are you? How are you, teacher? Uh, I'm fine. Uh, sorry. What happened uh, to you? What happened to you? Your job? Yes, yes. Uh, um, um, only working. Uh, 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 um, uh, very nice, nice, very nice, very nice, uh, very nice, and, and uh, driving for uh, my house is very nice, 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 nice. It's, it's, Oh, very no, late, very, very late, late at very, night. Very late, very late, yeah, very late. Very late at night, okay. Well, it is what it is, but you're back. Hopefully, you. uh, we're you, just teacher. we're just missing, after this one, we will only be missing three more classes and that's it. We're almost done. Okay, good evening, Erika. Good evening, everyone. Where's where's the party? Which party? <laughs> where's the party? Where is the party? Which which one? Uh, I, because I you know. you look so pretty, you know. Uh, <laughs> yes, I'm in a hairdo. <laughs> That's really good. Okay, man, where are the others? We're just seven. It's eight o'clock. Okay, guys, you may start the conversation. Come on. Okay, so we are nine already, it's 8.03. I'm gonna let you break the ice. Who wants to break the ice? Tell me something interesting that happened today to you. What, ha what happened today? In my case, we received a notification that we won a public tender today. So it was an amazing day. That's awesome. I'm, I'm sorry. Where? Oh, you're working in uh, when? Raf. Raf, right? Raf. Raf. Yes. A public tender. Yes, but I work. I work in the dental unit. Is a we have different units, business units. So we want uh, with our equipment, uh, X-ray. X-ray. Panoramic X-ray. Yes, for dental. Wow. Yes. For for the ease. Uh, in this case, Cefafa. Cefafa. Oh, 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 yes. I got it. I got it. Military. Yes, personal. but we are offering uh, one of this kind of equipment in East so, as well. So we hope to win. What so, part What part did you did you win? Uh, was it a technical offer? Or, the, uh, or you, complied, well, you complied with everything? Yes, 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 yes. Because we um, we participate with different competitors, and we have evaluated. Uh, no, we have been evaluated. We have been yes. evaluating. Uh huh. What? Yes, with in financials, in uh, technical. Wait, you have been evaluated by the government. Yes. In those in, aspects. Yep. Yes, in each offer we have we we, we are it. evaluated. Yes. Oh, okay, okay. So yeah, I mean, as every tender, it's complicated, it's complex, but I love that. It's it's, it's very interesting how to see how you can yes. see um, 
if you don't comply with something, you're screwed up. And I used to work for uh, tires uh, importing company. We used <laughs> to import tires. And yeah, we used to go on tenders, on, on public tenders as well. It was difficult yes. back in the days because, you know, right? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yes, we, we have lost a lot of tenders, but this we won. <laughs> awesome. And it's a, it's a good news for us. Of course. Yeah, I mean, each one of these equipments are very, very uh, expensive. Is it? Yes. <laughs> They're very yes. expensive and complicated to use. Are you going to train someone or? Yes, yeah, we are partners of Gerstring Dental. Uh, that is a brand of this kind of equipment. Mm. So, okay. Yes. They will do the installation and everything, I guess. Yeah, yeah. We import the, the equipment and our team install it. Install it. And their team installs. Installs. The yes. equipment. Okay. They go to the site and install it. That's awesome. That's really good. Okay. Thank you. Nice chat. Good guys. Uh, we are 20 already. So let's do the attendance. It's 906 already, 907. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. He was here. Yeah, I can see him. Andres Giovanni Valdivia Soportillo. Guys, please uh, turn on your camera. O sea, que enciendan la cámara, por favor. Ahora bien importante. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Present. Thank you. Dora Elizabeth Flores Mendez. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Present. Thank you. Erika Beatriz Lopez Morales. Present. Okay. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present teacher. Fernando Sorry. Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Francisco Amadeo Villacorta Chavez. Present. Freddy Vladimir Cortez Lopez. I'm here, teacher. Glenda Laura Celada Renderos. Amos Alfredo Garcia Granadino. Present. Josué Alberto Salas Benítez. Present. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Present. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Estefanía Carolina Reyes Sánchez. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Okay. Jessica Yanari Cortés Díaz. Okay. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Thank you. Roberto Luis Omaño Orellana. Suleima Ivonne Moreno de Hernández. Present. Irene Susana Cuellar Albanés. Present. Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. Present teacher. And Thelma Clotilde Peña Martinez. Thank you. <laughs> okay, guys, I hope you had a nice night last night and a great day today. We're in the middle of the week. Just think about it. Um, tomorrow may be our last class, and then we come back on Monday and Tuesday to finish the model. But please don't miss tomorrow. It's very important. Judy is just joining right now. Okay. Good just, evening, teacher. Hey, good evening. We're just missing Glenda and um, Stefania and Jessica. Teacher, excuse me. Tomorrow, okay. uh, tomorrow will not be a uh, class. We will have class tomorrow. Si tenemos clase mañana. Okay. El viernes tentativamente no. Okay, okay. okay. Mañana les confirmo. Okay. Okay. Okay, so let's get this started. Um, yesterday we talked about the article, right? We will cover that in this session, but also uh, we talked about another topic. What was it? Come on. What was yesterday's topic? Um, the use of the article. Comment. The or the... 
Thank you. Yes. <laughs> so, uh, M commerce. Comes... M commerce. What's going on in the world, right? With the M commerce. What What does the M stands for? Exactly. Mobile commerce, right? Mobile commerce. What do you understand by mobile commerce? That you can buy using just your phone, that's a wallet. Yeah, you can buy using your phone in any website, in any app, through any app. Today, I actually placed an order for some cables for the spark plugs of my car, and I ordered them. You know what they did? Um, I asked them if they accepted credit cards, right? And they said, mm, yeah. So can you send me the parts? And they, they, they said, okay, I will send you a link so you can pay for the parts. So I place the order, I, I tap, oh, I tap on the link. You tap with the tip of your finger, got it? You tap with the tip of your finger on the cell phone. You don't click, okay? You don't touch, you don't, I don't know. You just tap, tap, okay, tap. Oh, you can also slide, slide through the screen, okay? Slide your finger or you tap. So I tapped on the link. I enter my card information, my address, my name, and then I hit uh, purchase. It went through right away. I got a code. I took a screenshot and sent it to the seller. He sent the, the parts in 30 minutes. They were here, so it was really good. And I install it in the afternoon and the car is still won't turn on. So I know that sucks. Anyways, so <laughs> that's life. You know, I keep trying things until I get the right thing. So um, that was our topic yesterday. It's very interesting how you can place orders, you know, do whatever you want with your phone nowadays. And something I like seeing is when in social media, someone asks for money and they go like, hey, here's my QR code, you know, send me some money. And I'm like, wow. So you can just scan that code and send money to that person. It's amazing. But how did all this started? We're gonna start this class having groups. You're gonna have to create a presentation, be creative, find information online. Google, how do you say calambre in English? <laughs> let me check. I'm getting that, let me check. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm getting a let me check in one of my toes, my finger toes, I mean my foot toes. Oh God, that hurts. Okay, so you're gonna have to <laughs> Prepare a presentation. <laughs> How do you say that? Uh, is that, oh my God, I can't remember. Calambre. Electric shock. Mm -mm. That's not the word that I'm looking for. Ouch. Okay, so listen, go online, go online and find more crump. information. Crump? Crump. Can you type it? Yeah, crump. C-R-A-M-P? Crump, yeah, I'm getting a cramp on one of my toes. It's too cold. So thank you. <laughs> hey, go online and find information about the birth of M-commerce and its evolution worldwide, worldwide. Brainstorm on the milestones of the development of M-commerce in our country, in El Salvador. Prepare a timeline to compare the development of M-commerce worldwide and in the country, in our country. Questions? It's three bullet points, three bullet points that you need to fulfill in groups. Do you have questions on what's your task? Sure. Okay. So I'm gonna split you in small groups. Please work together as a team, okay? Teamwork is very important in these situations. Get together and participate. You're going to present one by one of the groups, okay? So decide as well who's going to 
do the exposition. If possible, if possible, create a presentation. If not, just take notes, okay? So you can present them to the class. Let's go. Irina and Roberto, please let's go to our groups. I was was born e-commerce in El Salvador. Oh really? But I don't know in another countries. Uh, um I guess the e-commerce born in 19, 1990. 99 so um, after other countries and um, but uh, but El Salvador uh, uh, had a had an access for for because El Salvador don't know about this 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 um, this concept, and and El Salvador no don't know use the, the tools for use e-commerce. But now with Chihuahua Wallet, we can use a mob mobile for buy. Something I think is is M commerce because uh, in another countries use M M F C is the same is using the phone as a credit card for paid your purchase in supermarket in Central America. Yeah, in another country, so it's, uh, it's, uh, Costa for example, Rica. Guatemala, Costa yeah, Rica uh, was uh, was the first country in using using e-commerce. Okay. And. Going to stop. <laughs> uh, maybe everyone uh, go to to internet and search information about it, and then uh, okay, okay, just go and then do do the presentation together. Okay. Okay, someone uh, have information yet? yet? I am looking. Like I have, I have uh, the the 
beginning date. Let me see. This is the beginning. Uh, when, when was the beginning about this concept? Um, that uh, turn started in 1997 by Kevin Duffy. In commerce. Okay. In a photo. Okay. In nineteen ninety for Kevin Duffy. Uh -huh. Yeah, Kevin Duffy. Uh, let me check about the evolution. Suppose they mentioned that it's like the Amazon mobile app or Apple Pay, Android Pay, Samsung Pay, in a digital wallet. Mm -hmm. Uh, the evolution of the mobile commerce. You can add the service, product and service. I send you a... The chat. Uh-huh, that's right. Ah, uh, okay. Service, mobile money transfer, mobile ticket. Okay. We have to add the evolution. Mm -hmm. Revolution or history? Yes. Yes. In this, uh, in this, but is in. in <coughs> In Spanish, you found information in Spanish. Yes, uh, tender. 
Yeah. Oh, it's the same information that same that same duty. Sorry, I know. But that part of the Coca Cola is interesting about mobile commerce service where first development in 1997 when the first two mobile phone enabled coca-cola vending machine were installed in the helsinki area in finlandia the machine accept payment by sms text message that is part of the story In lighting, okay. The next point. What is the meaning of milestones? Juvia. Brainstorm is, mm -hmm. is yeah, but mile, milestones. But milestones. That, that's like the point of start when something oh. just... Uh -huh where it started. In fact, it's very interesting. That word came from um, milestones. <laughs> you know, <laughs> back in the days where when there was no signs, you know, no, no signs on the roads, they used to put a, a, a stone, a stone mm -hmm. just pointing to the village. It used to say next village in 600 kilometers or things like that. It was a stone. So that okay. Was interesting. Okay. Like stone cage. Uh huh. Stone age. That's right. Stone age. Okay. Uh, mobile commerce in our country. In our country. That is supposed that we are going to define what can we do over here, right, teacher? or just yeah. I mean the whole point is for you to research you know do a research on how did it start who started it uh, mm -hmm. have a little timeline you know how it developed um, worldwide and in our country if you can right find any glitch here in in, in our country is there an m commerce you know we can only think about it uh, Chiva wallet for now, but I think there's other option. There are other options right now. Think about it. Yes. I don't know if you remember the the first app in El Salvador. <laughs> I don't know. First app. I think one of the most popular was eBay. When when the e-commerce started or began here in Salvador. But by locals. You, you copy, right? Yeah, I copy and I paste. 
but you copy the same thing that we did. Yeah, I, I can change oh. that. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, validate. Mm -hmm. but, huh? Bali. I don't remember how to write validate. Validate, it's B A E L. Teacher, you can, you can see the, the screen? Yes, I can. Validate, validate exactly like this. <clears throat> validate. Yeah. You have to close the, the fan. The what? The fan. Ventilador. <laughs> Do you want me to, to turn off the fan? No, no, no. You had your fan too close. Like me. Oh. Okay. And do, do 2000. You the 2000. There was no turning back of the 2000 mobile facility payments and transactions relating to parking, train, train ticketing, and voting mm -hmm. for favorite reality show contestants. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to put that. In, in a short lose. comment. It, yeah. This is the, the one that we just, search, right? Just the idea. Just the idea. Yeah. Just the idea. Just the idea. Mm -hmm. Of what it happened on um, two thousand. Okay. I'm going to I'm, go, I'm going to write again. Write there was down. no turning. There was no turning back after two thousand. Mobiles facilitated payments and uh -huh. transactions relating to parking, trade ticket, train ticketing, and Trust voting it. for favorite reality shows contestant. Yeah, yeah, I know, but but we can we can put a, a concept that mm -hmm. uh, I don't know something like the evolution of of mobile transactions. Just, just yeah, using idea to of evolution of mobile mobile transactions. Oh my god, I always forget how to write. Trans, 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 trans transaction. I think you forgot the S in R A A S. Ah, yes, yeah, like this. Trans, trans, transaction. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Evolution, Evolution of, of mobile transaction. transaction. Mm -hmm. Okay, how? What is the other thing that we can put? The, what about the, the examples? Yeah, we, but in the timeline, we, we only APR? have. In the timeline, we uh -huh. only <clears throat> can put, I don't know, dates, dates about, about the, the, the evolution of the M commerce. And yeah, there was even a shift of wallet from your pocket to your mobile phone in 2004, which the launch of Gcash. Okay, I'm going to put. Yeah, but the wallet, we're talking about the, not the shift of wallet, right? <laughs> no. No, but there we're is talking another about an electronic crypto. wallet, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's another. The ones that we read in the, in the paragraph. Yeah. I'm going to put 2004. 
Oh my God, I, I messed up. <laughs> no problem. You said that it's more difficult for you. To... Oh, the teacher is here. Hurry up. Right. Um, 2005, bear the Facebook. Oh. Facebook burn. That's you. Maybe hey. in Facebook was born and pero es que no, tiene, mándeme información concisa. O sea, yo tengo. Mm -hmm. <coughs> In 2005, create a Facebook. Escriban, escriban. Okay. In 2003, the Dutch department. <coughs> Okay, uh, share the screen. Uh, I was 55, I was 15, 2003, I created the Facebook. 2000. Hey, me lo puede mandar aquí al chat para agregarlo. Ahí, ahí está, 2003. <coughs> En 2005. En 2014, Santa, aquí en Ya lo tengo. En 2003, ya lo tengo. Uh -huh. Eso ya está. Uh -huh. 2006. Mándenme, cabal, mándenme años. Yo lo voy a ir agregando. Espera. Um... 2006. Sí, hubo. En 2008 tengo algo aquí. Oh. <laughs> 2007, Apple. Ah, no, es que es copy. Eh. Ok, ok, ok. Uh, Creo Oh. 
it. Quiero ver, ajá. Okay, en dos mil siete se movió a aplicaciones, pero. Uh -huh. okay. Una línea de tiempo pequeña. Así vamos sí, a ir tal, vez, tal vez no todos los años. Pues, pero... Ajá, o sea, cabal, ah, es que eso vamos. Eh, no necesariamente tiene que ser todos los años. 2020, 2000, 2000, 2000, 2000, 2000, 2000, 2000, 2000, 2000, 2000, 2000, Two thousand sixteen, the new Amazon. Mm Quiero ver qué más. ¿Qué me mandaron? 2007, el 2011. Uh, uh, no, ahora busquen en El Salvador. Ya tenemos, digamos, una pequeña base. Ahora busquen en El Salvador. En 99, No, pero ya fue e-commerce. E-commerce, ¿no? Ya fue e-commerce. Mm -hmm. Déjame ver aquí, encontré otra del 2008. Va ahora en El Salvador. Sí, yo solo lo que sé que, por ejemplo, Transfer 365 en el 2021. Lo más reciente.
What happened, boy? Boys, I have, I have the introduction. You hear me? Hello, guys. Glenda, Sandra, Stefania. Are you alone, honey? Chicos, han preparado algo. Perdón. Hola. Well, I, I have an introduction, teacher. Just the intro. Okay. Okay, okay. I don't know what happened. Was Luis in this group? Yes. Okay. He's coming back. Uh. It could be they they don't want working with me. Hmm. They don't want to work. With you don't say I that. Know. I, I... Don't worry. No. They will be back soon. Oh my god. Super yeah. Response. Is that compatible? Responsive. <laughs> I, had that, I had that problem with my one application that I developed. Well, because uh, I don't know, but uh, there are a lot of problems you are going to use uh, the navigator like a uh, edge or Internet Explorer because the the standard is on Chrome, Firefox, Ray, but it sometimes appear appear really different when you use exchange uh, explorer like age because they don't use a standard about the object Thank you. 
los policías y a los profesores y a mis otros compañeros. Así que me ha ido tú también. Okay. What were you telling? Sorry. About this, about about that you grow there. Is, is you don't have a good distribution about the object in your page, you are going to have serious problem to show the information at the customer. Okay. I don't know if mm, what I wrote it explain that you want to to say or you want to add any else I, I can I can say something about that when you you say you read and I'm going to explain something about I tell I'm going to explain something about what I'm saying about what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. About what I'm talking about. That sounds redundant. Okay. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Yes, I think. <laughs> 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 okay, I'm going to yes. give you two more minutes and that's it. Get ready. Judy, will you gonna, will you go, will you explain to our classmates? About what? Uh, all the presentation. <laughs> the presentation. You are the select one. I think you are. Yes, you know about, you know. A lot. A lot of, about this topic, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> did you want to talk about the first the first page and i'm going to explain like uh like the part that is more technique because that is a general information that is a general information too and services more and more for mobile ticketing. Mm. But I don't know, I, I did you want, maybe you can read the, the first three page and con can continue with the, the four and, Yes, I, I can explain the mm -hmm. this, these three pages. Maybe okay. Jarvin can explain these two or three. No, you can explain this one because you know about Strike and Bitcoin Beach. And you mentioned another one. Uh -huh. Moon wallet? Yes, it's the other one. Okay. No, teacher, not yet. <laughs> Man, I gave you a lot of time. <laughs> I hope you're ready. Were you able to do something, Thermita? Did, did they work? I'm ready, teacher. Hmm? I don't know what happened. 
you don't know what happened. I, it's just that some of your classmates, um, sorry, they had they were in a meeting, you know, or they were busy, but it's okay, don't worry. Yes, yes. Uh, 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 it, it's saying to me because and I I had a a meeting. Oh okay. But early. Earlier. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Don't worry, don't worry. Okay, so before we do this, I just gave you a lot of time to do it. I know you you got ready. Thank you very much for all of you that were working on a presentation and everything. We're gonna see the results right now. But first, let's do the attendance of 9 p.m. Although we're missing two minutes, but let's do it really quick. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Thank you. Turn on your cameras, please. Blank. Um, Andres Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present. Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Present. Dora Elizabeth Flores Mendez. Present. Edwin Alexandra Ayala Erazo. Present. Erika Beatriz López Morales. Present. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present teacher. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Francisco Madeo Villacorta Chávez. Present. Fredis Vladimir Cortés López. Glenda Laura Celada Renderos. Present. Amos Alfredo García Granadino. Present. José Alberto Salas Benítez. Present. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Present. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. He was here. Okay. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Stefania Carolina Reyes Sánchez. She's in a meeting right now. William Alexander Ramirez mm -hmm. Flores. Present. Jessica Yanari Cortez Díaz. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Roberto Luis Umaño Orellana. Suleima Ivonne Moreno de Hernández. Present. Irene Susana Cuellar Albanés. Present. Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. Present. And Selma Clotilde Peña Martinez. Present. Let's see the first time without. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. I saw you very interested in this topic. So let's start with the conversations, with the presentations. I'm sorry. The first group that I have is composed by, um, well, let me jump that group. Irene, Roberto, Jocelyn, and Suleima. We were the second okay. one. Yeah, you were the second. It's just that I don't know, Thelma, did you did you investigate? Did you research something? The first time without is it a physical store? This channel allows to look at <clears throat> product services and brands. Go ahead. Okay. Okay, this uh, this sells by catalogs uh, was like a boom in this time because the, the people choosing product only, only look, look by uh, photographs only. And, um, and this catalog emerged. Uh, the, people, the, the people don't, uh, don't look in, looking in, uh, in physical form, the product only really, really make they purchase at at the sales point, for example. At the point of sale, I got yeah. your point. Yeah, they used to prefer to buy things on physical stores, not online, and catalogs became the boom. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, in this in this time. 
back in the days. You can say back in the days okay. or okay. in those days. Excellent. Thank you. Okay. Thank okay. you. That's great. It's better if you just tell me, you know, what you have understood. If you prepare a presentation, awesome. Thank you. So let's move on with the second group, Irene, Jocelyn, and Suleyma. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, um, the e-commerce started with uh, sales by parallel and the term e-commerce was first coined in 1997 by Kevin Duffy at the Global Mobile Commerce Forum. And in that slide, you can see a graphic with the number of internet users around the world and the evolution uh, year by year. For example, in 2005, we have um, 1,100 users of internet around the world. And million. you can, oh yeah, millions, uh, sorry. And for example, in uh, 2019, you can see the number of user is increased and uh, 4,131 millions of uh, people around the world. So the e-commerce uh, is um, increasing year by year and uh, that is uh, a trend that no, never, never stops. So I don't have the, the data for uh, 1991, but I think it's uh, a lot of internet user than the 19 uh, and 2019. Yeah, from 2019 to, to 2022, it most likely it increased even more. Okay, keep going. Thank you. So now, Jocelyn, uh, okay. continue yeah. to uh, explain the second slide. Okay. Um, sorry. Okay. Could you continue? Could you move the second slide, Irene, please? Yes. Okay. In this moment. Thank you. Um, as Suleyma mentioned, uh, e-commerce supposedly was originally in 1997. Uh, in this. Uh, Slide we have minor selling commerce worldwide from the 2014 to 2021. Uh, we are talking about a billion of dollars. I would like to mention that e commerce, as his name uh, mentioned, is shopping online. And also, that is a consumer to consumer, business to business, business to consumer, and business to employee. <laughs> Okay, we had a slide that uh, since 2014, uh, just 1,336 uh, sales. But uh, today, in the 2021, we're for uh, 40, 40, 79, 79. And it continued increasing, even in COVID, I guess was most, more popular. Okay. Thank you. You can continue, Irene. Thank you so much, Jocelyn. I'm going to I'm going to talk about the evolution about this this concept between 1995 and 1998. Amazon, eBay, and Zappos inaugurate their first e-commerce service in this time which means a revolution in digital purchase. In this time, it, start, it started a revolution, a revolution about this concept. In 1998, Coca-Cola made it possible to buy its product by SMS and have them delivered to buyers' home. In this time, we can... Uh, See, it started a revolution about e-commerce because uh, um, talking about to buy in 
uh, why SMS is about uh, e-commerce. And then in this time, Coca-Cola made it possible to start this concept. Next. I don't know, I, uh, I think Alexander is, is not here. So in 1998, Rhythmoteca uh, 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 began it, its e-commerce in the music download sector. So if uh, in 2001, Amazon.com launched its, its mobile e-commerce, in 2002, eBay buys PayPal. In 2003, Apple launches its own store, iTunes. In 2004, NFC payments and key locations related acquisition were standardized. The payment card industry, PCI, Security Standards Council was also created. And in 2005, with uh, 2.0 peers making sites more interactive. In 2007, Pre Pretashop founded the most important e-commerce software company in the world. <laughs> and 2008, Magento is launched the great competitor of Pretashop over overall cast. And internet is everything. Its evolution has been to go from uh, 16 million users in 1995 with a penetration of 0.4% to 4,131 million in 2019 and a global penetration of 55%. This data compared the potential of e-commerce. Awesome, good job. Um, 2.0, you may read the web 2.0. When you see that 2.0, 3.0, 4.0, 4.5 and so on. Say, oh, sounds better. Good job guys. Thank you for researching so much. Just one thing, some pronunciation um, areas of improvement. When you say 2021, that's what you say. You don't say 2021, 2022, you say 2021, 2021, 2022, 2022, etc. The word between, between, between. The word purchase is not purchase, purchase, uh, purchase, purchase. Purchase, chess, purchase. Okay. In past, purchased. That's acceptable. Purchased. I purchased an iPhone last night. I usually purchase bread from the same guy. Okay. Mobile, mobile apps, mobile apps, mobile apps, mobile apps, mobile apps, mobile, mobile. Okay. You got it. Thank you very much. It was nice. Let's see if somebody can do it better. That was group number two. Let's go with group number three. I have Doris, Erika, Francisco, Jarvin, and Yuri. Japan was. What? <laughs> What's wrong with? Oh, Japan. Japan was leader. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. In M-commerce. Yeah, actually, in mobile. Yeah. And, and currently yeah. on mobile. Mobile devices is true. That's an interesting yeah, yeah. point, Thelma, because Japan is, is currently, it's an addiction for Japanese and Chinese as well. Man, yeah. They actually use very small cell phones. Most part of people, I don't know. Okay, let's see the evolution of M-commerce. Oh my God, go ahead, all yours. Okay, good evening everyone. Uh, we will add some information about uh, the evolution of e-commerce. So, as our classmates said before, the phrase mobile 
mobile commerce was first coined in 1997 by Kevin Duffy at the launch of the Global Mobile Commerce Forum. And the concept was brought to life in the same year by Coca-Cola, which installed two mobile phones enabled vending machine in Helsinki, which accepted payment by SMS text messages. Uh, there are some uh, important points about the evolution or statist statistical information about M-commerce. For example, M-commerce is grossing a 15% annual growth. 77% uh, of all mobile searches happen at home or work, or at both at work. 58% uh, of smartphones owners have already used a mobile device to purchase online. And 61% of consumers have a better opinion of your brand when, you're, uh, when you offer a good mobile experience. For that reason, your website uh, must have a responsive design to give a good experience to your customers. A uh, responsive design, uh, it means that uh, your website uh, have to adapt the content to different devices. For example, if you uh, see a website in your cell phone, uh, the size of your screen is different than if you, uh, you see the, the same website in your laptop, for example. So if your website have a responsive design, you can uh, see the content in different size of screens. Now Jarvin is, uh, will explain this information. Okay, hello everyone, good evening. In this sheet, we can watch the goods and service of e-commerce. For example, we have products and service, mobile motor transfers, mobile ticketing, mobile vouchers, mobile biking, and mobile pushes. The next one, please. Here in El Salvador, we were talking about it and Yuri shares about his experience, the most famous e-commerce that he knows. And he mentioned that the most popular was banking shopping oh sorry sorry this is the types of the e-commerce this is for banking shopping mobile payment the next one please and this is the 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 e-commerce that i mentioned before the most popular long time ago and jury shares his experience about it for example we can mention a strike bacon beach Memo Wallet. He gonna mention some quality about that and Juri play a little bit more about it. Yes, well, uh, this, those are uh, almost uh, sales, sales custodial wallet. What does it mean? You are, those, those wallets create your own bank. That means that you are responsible with the money that you have over there. If you lose the keys, you are going to lose your your funds. Uh, like a strike is working, actually is working in the United States in El Salvador, permitting transfer money from the United States to El Salvador, paying uh, a short fees. Bitcoin Beach is an application developed in El Salvador. The Moon Wallet is other one non-custodial wallet that permit transfer money to a second layer on Bitcoin network. And that is a Lightning Network. It's almost like a smart contract between two parts of companies. The timeline that we have is coin, coined by uh, 1997 by coin coined by Kevin Duff and PayPal in 1998. Amazon launch launch its first mon commerce platform in 2001. Apple launch 
iTunes in 2003 and Apple launched Apple Store in 2008. And that's all the information that we had for this topic. Great. Okay, let's see. Just a second. Okay. Let's see. So installed installed past install installed customers intonation customers okay or consumers consumers customers context final sounds context permitting transfer permitting to transfer or allowing to transfer that is an application that permit, um, that is an application that allows users, application that allows, and the pronunciation for everybody, because I noticed this for everybody, numbers, guys, numbers, 1998, 1999, you should sound confident, you know, all of you, 1999, 1998, 2000, I'll do it for you again, thousand, thousand thousand that's it one thousand two thousand etc okay thousand there you go that's the only feedback i got great job guys thank you and we're still missing two groups um 10 minutes okay let's see blanca edwin josue and william hey, I'm going to going to explain you. Okay, good evening to everyone. Uh, as everyone knows, um, the phrase mobile commerce uh, born in 1997 by Kevin Duffett in the launch of global mobile uh, commerce. The concept um, was brought to life in the same year by Coca-Cola, which installed two mobile phones enable uh, vending machines in, in which accept the payment uh, via text messages. Uh, it born in, in this in, in 1997, right? So the validity of uh, the validity of the concept was in 1998. And there was no turning back after 2000 because uh, mobiles facilitating payments uh, and transactions related to parking, train tick, um, ticketing, embodying to the favorite reality shows, constants, uh, you know, et cetera. There was even a chief of wallet from your pocket to your mobile phone in 2004, while in the launch of cash. Uh, but uh, uh, the time of, uh, of the commerce, uh, for example, from 1997 to 2000, 2021, like we have are now a different, um, different between all this uh, uh, commerce and and how the the to compare the timeline to 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 those times. Nowadays, the the technology changed everything, so that's what we have. But like, like that's everything that has advantage and disadvantage, you know, uh, that we need to handle with this because uh, shopping online has uh, sometimes uh, it can be good, but sometimes it don't, right? But what are the three types of e-commerce? There are three main types of e-commerce, business to business and websites such as uh, Shopify, a business to consumers uh, websites such as uh, um, Amazon, 
and con consumer to consumer uh, websites such as uh, eBay. Um, but uh, the, the, um, the concept uh, to the term of electronic commerce refers to, to a business model that allowed companies um, in individuals to buy a sales uh, goods and service over the internet. And e-commerce operate um, in four major market segments and can be conducted over computers, tablets, smartphones, and other smart device. So you can find in, 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 in all of and uh, and all those things, you know, those those things that we now we already have in, in, in the technology. Um I I think it's everything. Thank you, teacher. I think that's all. That I think that's all. Yep, you got it. Okay. Uh, I just noticed two observations. I just tried not to speed up, speak mm -hmm. slowly, you know, articulate a little bit more. The first M commerce born. The first M commerce was born, was born. That's the passive voice, was born. Sometimes it don't, sometimes it doesn't, sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. Nice comparison. And the last group is composed by Andres, Irwin, Fernando, and Amos. Ready whenever you are. Okay. Uh, beer of um, commerce, uh, the phrase mobile commerce, well, that, that paragraph <laughs> uh, was a has appeared in now the, the exposition, but uh, the, the mobile commerce uh, was first coined in, wait, wait, what is happening? Ah, okay. Uh, was first co coined in, sorry, I have <laughs> issues. What, what is happening? I am, I am not clicking. Wow. Let me check the, Okay. Uh, by Kevin Duffy and launched the, the Global Mobile Commerce Forum. Uh, the first, the first bot in in the life uh, was in the same year by Coca Cola using a, a SMS text message uh, and using a, a, a beeper. I don't, I, I don't know if you remember that that is that device. Uh, in Japan, in, in, the, in the same year, year uh, the first person like mobile application was introduced uh, uh, when the, the web page uh, was creating, the, the responsive design concept doesn't exist. So if you want to, 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 shop, to, to watch a, 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 a web page in a browser, uh, for example, a P, PDA in, in that time, it's like a, ta a tablet. Uh, you you can watch the the the, the web page in the right way because uh, the, the the web page was created for a bigger screen. So when you when, when in 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 nineteen ninety nine, uh, maybe the 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 approaching approaching like mobile application with responsive design for for view, viewing in, in, a, in a little device, for example. Uh, the first transactions of tangible cuts took place in 2003, 2003 in a Twitch department. Uh, they launched a, a campaign with this message. And in the same format, uh, in that time we we had beeper, and they receive a, a message with promotion, and you can you can pay with with codes. Um, two thousand seven, mobile commerce had moved from SMS to actual application. Uh, 
in the years appears uh, some application or maybe web page like Google, it is more or less in the, that time, Facebook born and uh, that that uh, took place to to the to the change and to to the to the start of the some application at that time. Uh, uh, in the US, in the US, in two thousand eight, uh, the in they used a mobile web to pay for product of services, and that was validate, validating for person that the age uh, was the, where we win in in two uh, eighteen years and thirty two years. And in holidays in 2011, uh, that was a big boom because uh, we uh, the gaming commerce users increased by uh, 173%. Uh, and in, in that time, I remember uh, I, I don't have a, uh, the, 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 I don't have a, I didn't have a, a, a smartphone or, or in, in that time that was uh, that were Blackberries and iPhones, for example, the, the more nowhere's brands in that time. And I remember uh, some apps uh, that I, I used in that time and was, was a, a, a big, it, when when came to El Salvador was a whatever I remember all the, the all the guys uh, went to to get a BlackBerry for example yeah. that is maybe the in in our world that was uh, for the globalization a big boom and in El Salvador uh, we we did some research about the apps in El Salvador and we found for example. In 2009, Pagadito, uh, that that start as a, a method of payment in web. But that I said, for example, if you can, if you can use a a, a web page in, and you can watch a web page in the right way in your phone, that is e-commerce because you do the the transactions in your phone and take your money. In, 2011, that's it. Good job, okay, great job for just a few words. Uh, birth, 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 uh, birth, birth. Mm -hmm. you got it. Yes, and I, I had some problem with the, with the change of the times in <laughs> present and past. I, I, I tried to correct that it's okay, don't worry, you will make it. The most known brands, the most known brands, you can also say the most popular brands. It was a boom. You didn't know how to say, man, it was like, it was a boom. It was very popular in 2009, 2009, thousand. Just think about a Z guys, and that's it. Great job, thank you very much for preparing the presentations, adding a little bit more on each of the presentations. I think it, the topic is clear and e-commerce is a great thing actually. Okay, let me see, let me follow B. I was paying attention to you. So regarding the article, the article, when do we use the article? I'm, just not, I'm not going to torture you anymore with, this but one more observation some of you i think i'm not gonna say names but <clears throat> uh, you were saying for buy for pay remember to verb for noun again to verb for noun so to buy to pay okay now in another country singular another singular other plural 
in other countries. In another country, got it? These are just notes that I took from what I was listening to a few minutes ago. Okay. Let's continue. Let me see if I can do this. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. Is that all? Is that all? Yeah. I think that's good enough, but it's not going to be okay format. Let me go smaller and it's not clear enough. So let me do five and five. One, two, three, four, five. And okay. Okay, let's go with this five first, and then we go with the other five. Help me. Do we need the article or not? This is men who I was talking about. I think women are more sensible than men. This is sixth day of our holidays. We prefer going by ferry to fly, and I never watch television in afternoon so first sentence what do you think do we need the article the i think yes we i think so it. i think we do repeat i think so i think we do teacher i think we do i think so <laughs> i, think, I so. think so yeah we definitely need it okay why because we're we're being very specific again I think this is the man who I was talking about. This is the man, the man who I was talking about. So it's on the context that this guy is the one that I was talking about. Okay. Oops. Okay. Next. I think. With Audi. William again. Mm, <laughs> You know what? I think I was having a heart attack a few minutes ago uh, when I, well, you were in your expositions, but I was so nice that I didn't stop you. My arm is falling slip. It's like hormigando. Google, how do you say hormigando in English? God. And my whole arm hurts, you know, and my chest. I'm missing air. Hormigando. <sighs> yeah. Itching. Itching. Yeah. Itching is like. It's better. Say, is it like sleep? Mm -hmm. oh. Yeah, falling asleep or something. Uh, tingling. Numb. Yeah, tingling and it was like numb. It is still like pickle. Numb. Pickle, pickle, maybe. That sounds right. Okay, I think women are more sensitive. It should say sensitive, sensible than men. Um, so I'm generalizing, right? Yeah. Yeah. So no article. Got it? I think I think the women. I'm sorry. I think the the women. I know. I think the women. I know. Okay, that's different. This is sixth day of our holidays. Read article. This With is good, Thelma. Yes. This is, this. The uh, this is the sixth day of our holidays. This is the sixth day of our holidays. I'm very. I'm being very specific. I, I'm, I need to emphasize that this is our sixth day, the sixth day for holidays. We prefer going by ferry to flying. Come on, guys, Doris, Alexander, Erika, everybody. No article. No article? No. Yeah. May you read it? We prefer going to buy ferry to flying. Going to buy ferry? We prefer going by ferry to flying. Yeah. Going yeah. Going by after one preposition, you will never use the article unless you're being very specific again. Okay. Next. You never watch television in the afternoon. Definitely. Why do we need this, teacher? Why do we need the article here? Where is this? And we are specific time. telling about the time. 
uh, part of the day, in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, but be careful at night, okay? Good. At midnight, okay, good. Next, I went to London and saw, it's too small, Erika? Yes, sorry. <laughs> there we go. Okay, Thank I you. went to London and saw National Gallery. The National Gallery. National yeah, Gallery. the National Gallery. Gallery. Yeah, and so the National Gallery. Good. Why? That's not a. That's a common noun, right? Yeah. Okay. Next, she often goes riding on. Okay. <laughs> no article. Perfect. No article. Oh, no. Good. Coffee is a popular drink in Spain. No article. The coffee? Okay. No, right. Okay. Coffee is a popular drink in Spain. I am listening to a programming on radio. On the radio. On the radio. On the radio. I don't take the sugar in my coffee. No article. No. No. Correct. No article. I don't take sugar in my coffee. Thanks. Uncountables. Uncountables. You don't need the article. The vegetables are good for your health. No. No article in general, all vegetables, right? You could do that. You can say all vegetables are good for your health or just no article. Vegetables are good for your health. Got it? Questions? No. Okay. Here, you said before that we don't use for with verb. Exactly. But for example, if you say thanks for coming, it's oh. correct. <laughs> when you add ing to a verb, you may be changing the verb into a noun. Okay, so but that's the use of gerunds, and of, uh, you can use gerunds after four. Okay, this is for eating vegetables. When you talk about the purpose of something, a bowl. You know, you know what is a bowl? Yeah, yeah. A bowl. A bowl is used for vegetables. A, a bowl is used for. I'm sorry, it's used for eating. El it's for drinking. Yeah, it's used for drinking soup. 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 For eating okay. Chinese food, for example. I was made for loving you, baby. Don't cry, teacher. Exactly. Okay. <laughs> to talk. We came here to talk. Okay. For talking. We can hear for talking. We came here, be careful, for a talk. We came here for a talk. Okay? It makes more sense. For a talk, I'm not using the verb as a verb, but as a noun. Okay? Thank you. Thank you for paying attention. <laughs> okay. Let's keep it up. It's 9.41 already. I'm staying, by the way, tonight I'm staying with... Ta -ta -ta -tan. Tan -tan -tan -tan. Let me see. Dora, Elizabeth, do you have 10 minutes after the class? Yes, teacher. Awesome, awesome. good. So we're staying together. Okay, moving on with the um, items on your book. Let me see if this is it. Yeah, but no. 
Mm -hmm. hmm. Yep. Okay, there are some terms that we haven't talked about and they're not covered until the next, um, well, are they're not covered on the lesson plans. Uh, page 35, what are some changes that retail stores have adopted in recent years? How do you think retail stores will be in the future? You remember the, the video we, we saw yesterday about Amazon stores? That was amazing, right? I think that the, that will answer the questions, right? These are the changes that they are implementing, implementing that allowed you to have a better experience when you go to a retail store. What else have you noticed uh, technologically speaking, let's say, what else have you noticed on retail stores? Walmart has a feature that I really like. What is it? What is it? Yeah. <laughs> what happens? What happens when you you grab an item at Walmart and and there's no price? It's just the barcode there. What do you do? You can check it. How? Check the price. You can scan the barcode. Where at the register? No. no there is a little much in, in every line. Yeah. Not in every line. Not every, in every line. Don't no, lie. No, not in every line. Ah. Like two and one. <laughs> hey, why do you think that other supermarkets haven't adopted that idea? What what will it be? You know, that's a great idea. They don't trust, maybe. They don't trust? But I mean, why will it affect you? Culture. If... What? Our culture. Come again. Don't People don't trust in anyone. People don't trust anyone, but what does it have to do? If you're buying a product, there is no price. You just check the price. Oh, okay. That's a great, a great thing. But in other supermarkets, okay, in selectos, you have to go to the register, right? Give me how much is it, right? Is mad. <laughs> yeah, sometimes I'm really mad. Yeah, that's not okay. Okay, so yeah, that's uh, that's part of the good experience on customer service from their end. What else? What else have you seen on retail stores? I don't know, Seaman or places like that. Did you could tell technology is impacting those retail stores? We talked about this before. Come on. Um, Juguetón offer the same service. Really? Yes. Hmm. The I... store that have a... Uh, no. It's near to the... Los Heroes? Redondel Master Prayer. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Redondel. Runabout. Roundabout. Roundabout. Uh, Masferrer Roundabout, near to the Leaps. Yes. I don't know that <laughs> place. I love the tacos. Yes. The tacos. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I got you. So they do have a check, a check machine. I don't know how to call that. A scanner. They do have a scanner in some aisles, in some aisles. Mm. Okay. So what do you think is the future of these stores, of the retail stores? What else will they have to adapt to? No idea, okay. Let's find out, okay. Uh, let's do this together and find a definition. I'm not gonna split you. I know that you're tired, so let's do it together. But I need to hear other people. Erwin, you're very quiet. Um, Stephanie is just arriving home, I think. Um, Luis is very quiet. Jocelyn is very quiet. Sandra too. Irene, Judy, Amos, Jarvin, Glenda, Alexander, Jose Alberto, 
Lanka, don't fall asleep, guys. Suleima, okay. Everybody, and by the way, please turn on your cameras. So we're almost done, guys. We're missing 30 minutes. Let's do this together. Find the definition of each word. What's the meaning? And you have three minutes right now. So let's read together and find the definition. Three minutes. Okay, one minute. Okay, let's see, what is brick and mortar business? The business business that complete most of their business activities at a physical location. Yeah, physical, right? Mortar, mortero, brick, ladrillo, right? Okay, that sounds like right. Clicks and mortar. Uh huh. Come on, guys. I think that it's to about the internet and building and building to conduct business. Yeah. <laughs> yes, you got it. Yeah, that sounds like very logical, right? Okay. It's number two. What's number three? E workforce. People hired to work with computers while doing business. Good job. Yeah. It's just mainly sense, pure sense. Okay. Uh huh. Number four, e tailing. Selling of retail. It's the selling of retail goods on the internet. E what was it? E tailing. Hmm. I had a yeah. with this. Yeah, but it, it makes sense because it comes from tail. It sounds like the tail, you know, the cat's tail, the dog's tail, your tail. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like tail. And I heard before in another job, tailgating is not allowed. Tailgating. I can't remember if it was together, but you know, what's tailgating? No? no. Um, really quick, uh, super rápido. Cuando trabajaba en Dell, tú tenías que pasar el batch para entrar a la empresa, al piso de producción, y adentro estaba también la cafetería. Entonces nos permitían um, llevar a una persona al día, si queríamos, un familiar, y pues le daban un batch provisional y podíamos almorzar con esa persona. Por ejemplo, mi papá se dio gusto, siempre llegaba a comer conmigo. Entonces yo lo lo guiaba, solo yo tenía acceso, so, solo mi batch tenía acceso a la puerta, el de él no, el de él solo era un muro, un mero ID, so I used to tailgate him, yo le daba acceso, pues. in other words, tailgate him, that's an interesting term, okay, number five, e-wallets, software that is store personal, personal, personal and personal information, personal information for wanted reuse, 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 reuse. 
yeah, that's five e-wallets. And they're very popular nowadays on, in the United States. Number six, multi-channel shopping. Multi Offering shop. customers a variety. Variety. Uh, uh, do it, do it. You can do it. Variety. Variety. <laughs> variety. Oh my God. Variety. variety. Offering customers uh, a variety. 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 Uh, <laughs> I'm going to do that again. Variety. Variety. There you go. Good. Variety. Platforms from which they are able to purchase. Product. Purchase products. Very good. Offering customers a variety of platforms from which they are able to purchase products. Again, offering customers a variety of platforms from which they are able to purchase products. Purchase, purchase. There you go. Hmm. And so on. Then you can do this or we can do it tomorrow actually read the following trends. And well, actually we're missing, um, hold on, about five minutes, let's do it. We have some trends that are taking place in retail stores. We need to rank them from one to five indicating which will be more important in future years. One is most important, five is less important. So let's see, just gonna read them for you, think about it. Stores providing unique in-store experiences will be more successful. Now that's a physical store providing unique experiences. <laughs> okay, what unique experiences? Retailers across the world will adopt mobile payment solutions as the ones we have been talking about. Retailers will set smaller stores to be able to compete with bigger corporations. Mm. We'll set smaller stores to be able to compete with bigger corporations. Mm. Having more branches. Mm. I don't know, Rick. I can think about an example right now. Mm. Shipping purchases in the same day will be the norm. Shipping purchases in the same day will be the norm. Hmm. Retailers will need to take advantage advantage of apps, services, and third parties to fill the needs of modern shoppers. Okay, what's the most important in the future? Come on, come on. The second. Retailers across the world will, will adopt mobile payment solutions. Mm, what do you think, guys? Trends that are taking place in retail stores. I think that the first one is the last. Okay, Retailers but... will need, yeah. Okay. So it's one to five. You say that the one above is the last one. So this should be number five. No, I guess this is, is, that is one the most important because nowadays the customer experience is the most important for the customers. Okay. So they will not, yeah, because- To give, to give yeah. them experiences that, that that they have some benefits from the service that they need is the number one rule nowadays. So you, you think that achieving customer satisfaction in physical stores goes first? Yeah, mm -hmm. because every, nowadays the experience is the most trending things on the, on the retailers. In the retail stores? Yeah. Okay. So from the point of view of Stefania, guys, uh, treating the customers right is like very important, is trend. For me, is the last one. Retailers will need to take advantage of, of apps, services, and third parties to fulfill the needs so, of modern shoppers. 
that's the that's more important for me because if Wait. you if you don't uh, take <laughs> all the modern things modern things, uh -huh. you're going to be I Successful. don't know how to say estancado. <laughs> you're gonna be stuck. Yeah. Uh, but okay. nowadays pandemia pandemic has to pandemic i'm sorry pandemic ha, eh, I, don't, how did, I don't know how it's forced forced yeah forced the all all the <laughs> industries or retailers to move on on the <laughs> web apps or something like that okay i'll leave this as homework we don't have much time <laughs> uh but guys think about it read the carefully read the following trends that are taking place in retail stores they are taking place right now okay and then think about what will be more important in future years so if we follow stefania's example if this is happening right now stores are providing unique in-store experiences mm, will that be more important in the future i mean if they already have uh, i don't know apps most likely people won't go anymore to physical stores, right? Think about it. Bring me your results tomorrow. Oh no, homework. Yeah, sorry, but no sorry. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow at eight o'clock. I'm staying with Doris. Let's do the attendance again. Um, where are you? Where are you? There she is, okay. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Thank you, Sulema, right. Sulema Yuris, Amos, Josue, Glenda, turn on your camera. Okay, Andres Giovanni Valdivia Soportillo. Present, good night. Good night. Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Present, good night. Good night. Edwin Alexander Ayala Eraso. Present, good night, teacher. Thank you. Erika Beatriz Lopez Morales. Present. Good night. Good night. Did I say Dora Elizabeth Flores Mendez? Present. Thank you. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present teacher. Good night. Good night. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Good night. Good night. Francisco Amadeo Villacorta Chavez. Present. Good night. Good night. Fredis Vladimir Cortez Lopez. Glenda Laura Celada Renderos. Present. Good night. Good night. Amos Alfredo Garcia Granadino. He's there. Okay. Jose Alberto Salas Benitez. Present. Good night. Good night. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Yuri, he's there. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Present. Good night, Luis. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present, good night. Good night. Stefania Carolina Reyes Sanchez. Present, good night. Good night. William Alexander Ramirez Flores. Present. Jessica Yanari Cortez Díaz. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present, good night. Good night. Roberto Luis Omeño Orellana. Suleima Ivonne Moreno de Hernández. Present, good night. Good night. Irene Susana Cuellar Albanés. Present, good night. Good night. Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. Present. Good, Good night. night. And Thelma Clotilde Peña Martinez. Good night, teacher. Hey, good night, Judy. Good night, Thelma. Good night, teacher. William, I think I mentioned your name. I'm sorry, teacher. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> good night. Okie dokie. How are you, Doris? Uh, fine, fine, fine. <laughs> Great. I think there's something wrong with my blood pressure. I know. And in time, I few months ago I have a, a this this problem with my arms. With your uh, arms. In, in uh, my shoulder, in, uh, in my shoulder, right? And I, I go, I went to the um, how, how do you say is the no, it's a chiropractor to the chiropractor. 
Yeah, yeah I, I have a I have a sister in church. <laughs> mm -hmm. She's a pneumologist, a children mm -hmm. children pneumologist, maybe the best children pneumologist in El Salvador. She's very smart. But whenever I have a doubt, I text her, you know, and she's asking me to go to a cardiologist as well. Oh, I, 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 I have a control with cardiologist. With cardiologist, with a cardiologist. Okay. Yes, my heart is bigger than the other people's. I know, I have a big heart. <laughs> <laughs> in, 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 he said me, don't worry, many people's many have, people have a big, a big, a big heart. heart but it's a yes a, you only uh, lost weight uh, you just you just need to lose to lose weight you just need to lose weight you only need to lose weight you only need to lose weight you just need to lose weight hey um he tells me or he told me he uh, he he told me Okay, cuando usamos tell es directo a una persona. Tell me, tell you, tell my mm -hmm. mom. Okay, and when you use in general, you know, you say say. Mm -hmm. no? mm -hmm. uh, some people say. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, that cardiologists are da 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 da. Um, I heard it's different. I heard a lot. Okay, so are you married? No, I'm single. You're single or divorced or widow? I mother single. You're a single mom. A single, single mom. mom. Okay. Single. How many children do you have? One. Yes. Just one. one. Yes. Yeah, what? it's a she. No, she. She. Yeah, she's a woman. Married woman. She's a married, <laughs> married. Married woman. Mm, repeat, married. Married. Not, not read, uh, married. Not read. Married. Married. Married woman. Married woman. She's a married woman. Really? Uh, yes. So uh, uh, I have uh, two grandsons. You have two grandsons, really? Yes. Okay. Are they learning English? They, they, they. Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, or how they, old are they? What? Uh, uh, How old are they, your grandsons? Uh, Miguel, uh, the older uh, uh, yes. is uh, 10 years old. The older uh, is, is 10 years old. Uh -huh. uh, younger is uh, eight, year, eight, eight years, old. years old. Eight years old. Eight years old. Repeat. Eight is year old. Again. Eight years old. Er, eight. Eight years old. Good, good. So, are they learning English at school? Yes, in the uh, they live. They live in Germany. What? Yes. No. Wow. So they are learning German. Yes. <laughs> Wow. Uh, they are speaking Germany in the uh, school, learning uh, French mm. and English. And English. Okay. Yes. They speak in German and they are learning English and French. Do you know, right. that's something that I admire and envy of Europe. Because in Europe, you must you must learn at least three or four languages yes. in, in, in germany the, the most people learn, uh, speaking uh, besides the germany uh, uh, spanish and english and french okay uh, german german That's the language before uh, other than German, they speak other languages, but but that's because of the location. That's because of the location of Germany. Yes. Mm -hmm. in, 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 
for my grandson. We he they live in uh they live in South German. In South Germany. Okay, so around Munich. Yes. In around Munich. So they need to speak Polak. They're close to Poland. Uh in Prague. Prague. What's the language in Prague? I can't remember. Paris, they're close to they're close to France. Yeah, they're close to France. Switzerland, Austria. Switzerland. And when I uh, when I went visit the a few years ago, mm. I, I I visited uh, a French and Swiss. Switzerland. Switzerland, yeah, Switzerland. France, France. Uh -huh. yeah. And Switzerland, really? Man. Yes. Even like, Spain. To the Estrasburg and other towns in France. In France. Spain. <laughs> <laughs> Spain is not that far. Well, actually, yes, it is. It is a mm -hmm. little bit far away. Wow. That's, that's what I really envy about Europe, you know, you have all these countries that so uh, close, so close, and you have to speak their language. I mean, they're neighbors. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Man, even mm -hmm. Russia. Let me see. Russia. Ah, there, are, there are many Russian in Germany. Oh, yeah. I, the, my grandson has a, has a teacher, Russian teachers. A Russian in, teacher. Yes, at school. Oh my yeah. God, I have never seen how big Russia is. Russia yeah. is, 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 is bigger than the United States, actually, I think. That's really impressive. Wow. Wow, we should check the map more often. <laughs> We're very small compared to Russia. Oh my God. Wow. Well, that's important. Hey, we need to practice. Just have a conversation with your grandsons. Why not? May, uh, yes. Uh, uh, my daughter said to me. Told me. Told me. You must learn in English. <laughs> when you, you visit me, visit me, you can speak in English, but for the German is so difficult for learning. Yeah, German is good for all in. Yeah. It's more difficult. Okay. Well, but, thank, uh -huh. thank you for staying with me those 10 minutes. Text me if you need any help, okay? Thank you, teacher. Good night. <laughs> Goodbye.